Hey Glamazons, it's me, and this is a jewelry haul video, along with other things, obviously. Um, so let's just jump right in. Sorry if I sound funny, I am a little under the weather. So, first of all, in my hands, I have another hat here. I have been purchasing my winter hats, and this is just a fur hat that I got from eBay. It's beautiful. It is not real fur, because I don't really like to wear real fur. If you want to see it in better detail, there are photos on Instagram. It's a really cool hat. And my arm is too small to like really show you guys what it looks like. <laughs> um, here I have some Infinity Scarves by Chatties. They show you the different ways to wear them, which is cool. And this one is just like a lavender with purple, pink, and black stars and suns. It's really cute. Picked up another scarf, and this one is a, just a red plaid. I thought it was really sexy. So, I like this one. And Infinity Scarves are circles. Hopefully, you guys can see. It's just a circle scarf. And they show you different ways that you can wear them. Anyway, continuing along. I picked up, I told you guys I bought the full size of that little mini perfume that I got in Little Italy. So here it is. It's Marilyn Miglin Aura. And this is the bottle. It's very heavy, very pretty. I really like this scent. Again, I'm not a huge fan of her perfumes, but this one is really nice. So I bought the full size bottle. You can get a pack of two off of HSN for 40 I just bought one single one from eBay. And so there you go. This is a hair clip. I got it on sale at Payless. I purchased some shoes, which will not be in this video, but if you want to see them, there's pictures of the shoes on my Facebook page. Check out my Facebook page because sometimes there are things there that you won't see here on YouTube. So, it's just a hair clip. Original price was 10 bucks. I got it for like $3. thought it was really pretty. Also from Payless, I picked up this really cute headband it's just a headband it was also three dollars was originally twelve ninety nine I just thought this would be pretty for winter time it looks kinda like a jeweled snowflake or something doesn't it very pretty I also picked up these headbands here which this one's a mint green with silver beading they're just headbands and again I need to make room I need to put this stuff away this one is coral and gold tone. Very nice. They're just, again, headbands. They were originally $10. I got them for $3. They were on clearance. I don't really think of accessories. I don't really think of Payless, but hey, it was by the register and they were really nice. Um, I also picked up, as I dropped things... This really cool phone case for my iPhone. It's the Juicy Couture phone case. Really cute. I could not resist this. So, that's that. And let me pick up the other phone case I just dropped. I also picked up this phone case. The... <clears throat> Excuse me, when you put your phone in here, it looks like a bottle of vodka. I thought that was so cute. I've seen beer bottle cases too, but I just thought this one was really, really cute. So, really cute. Just a phone case. I have some more phone cases coming, so stay tuned. Um. Okay, I ordered more from Trendy2Fashion.com. And this is what I received. She sent me this beautiful necklace for free. Look at that. Let me see if I can get it open. Thank you, Veronica, in case you see this video. Sorry I haven't gotten back to you, but I've been really under the weather lately. So I'll get back to you as soon as I'm feeling a bit better. But look at this beautiful necklace. This is stunning. I love it. I can't wait to wear it. Look at that. Thank you so much, Veronica. That's the back. I like this so much. I would have bought this. This is gorgeous. She also sent me this little set, which I'm not going to take out the pack. 
It's just a little pendant with the earrings. It's cute. She sent that with the purchase. Now, these are the earrings that came with the necklace I bought. And here is the necklace I bought. And if it looks familiar, it's the still for the video I did reviewing Trendy 2 Fashion. So yeah, I went on ahead and just purchased the necklace. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. And it's on a nice beaded chain. The lobster claw clasp. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. And again, these are real glass and shell, so... I really like it. I like the hot pink colors. I think it's just beautiful. I was just picturing this with a cream colored sweater, like maybe the color of this background. Or like even a burgundy sweater or a gray sweater. This would be really pretty, so... And it's got the nice soft cushion on the back. I wish you guys were here because you would smell a beautiful candle burning. I had to share this. I shared this on my Facebook page. For my birthday, I got four of these candles. They're called Bella Candles, and they were buy one, get one free, which they're not having that anymore. So I got them from a relative for my birthday. Inside the candle, it's a scented candle in a glass jar, and inside the candle is a sterling silver ring like they bury a sterling silver ring inside the candle when the candle burns something shiny starts to pop up and it's a ring this one is in the relaxation scent and I also have one in the fruit punch scent and so it's what's burning in my room now and my ring already came out and it is sterling silver and I'll show you guys what the ring looks like there's the ring it's got yellow stones. How cute. So you get the candle and the glass jar is reusable, which I can't wait because I'm going to clean the jar out and I'm going to um, put my Q-tips and cotton swabs in there. And the, the, the jar has a really nice lid and everything, so it's really cute. You can put candy in them, you can put your cotton swabs and everything in there. And you get a sterling silver ring and you get to enjoy a really nice scented candle. The only problem was shipping took forever. I didn't get my candles for like a month, which sucks because they were a birthday gift. So if you get a chance, check out their website. You know, this is my personal opinion. They did not sponsor this or, you know, they, they don't even know who I am. So anyway, remember, guys, I said I went to Little Italy and I did some jewelry shopping during the Feast of San Gennaro. Well, I bought a lot of semi-precious um, pendants. Now, the stones are real, but... It's set into, like, not silver. So anyway, I bought this Mother of Pearl shell necklace. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? You can really see the rainbows even on camera. It's gorgeous. It's a real shell. And I wish it was sterling silver, but it's not. I might put it on a sterling silver chain, though. How cute. I bought this heart pendant here. It's a venturine. It's just... You know, the metal's not real, but the stones are. And they were only $3. And, you know, if you go online, you can spend anywhere from 10 to 20 something dollars on pendants like this, you know. Look at this one's a fluorite, and it's handmade. They're big. Nice, beautiful stones. So, I'm just showing you guys the ones I handpicked. This one is rose quartz beautiful I am into gemstone lore and all that stuff I love it another rose quartz this one's a heart it's just like the green one except this one's rose quartz this one is unikite which I have a lot of unikite jewelry and silver but you can see here this wiring has started to turn because it's not real silver but that's okay if anything I'll put them on leather cords or sterling silver chains and you know what? At the end of the day, even if this metal turns or whatever, I'll always have the gemstone. You know, for $3, it's worth it just for the gemstone. That's how I look at it. This one looks like some sort of milky aquamarine. I'm not sure, but it's really pretty. I got some agate slices. Purple one. This huge pink agate slice here. Which it looks better from this angle. Really cute. Another agate slice. Because, you know, each one's different. This one has more color to it. You can see my fingerprints all over it. 
This is another fluorite. This is a smaller one, but look at this. What a pretty stone, right? Really, really pretty stone. So, fluorite. This stone looks like some sort of jasper. I'm not sure. But I like this side. Look at that. It's really pretty. And they had some pearl jewelry. Organic looking pearls. So, yeah, I bought two of these and I thought they were really, really nice. And again, I wish they were sterling silver, but for $3 they weren't going to be in sterling silver. It's okay. <laughs> I'll enjoy it. And like, you know what? You'll always have the stone. I can always pop these settings out and just keep the stones. And, you know, make friends with a jeweler and have them set into gold or silver. So, anyway guys, that's it for this video. I have another jewelry video coming up. And I have purchased more hats and phone cases, so there will be another video. And I've been making a lot of fine jewelry purchases, but I'm not going to show you guys. But this stuff, I figured this was kind of fun. I don't buy this kind of stuff often. And it's not completely fake, but it's not completely real. So, I think the technical term is bridge jewelry. The stones are real and the metal's fake. But, hey, it's still interesting, right? Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.